Welcome back to the running on BT Sport, where now we're getting down to Survivor Series business this year's Survivor Series 2021. And we are joined by someone who is a part of Team SmackDown. But before we get to Jeff's take, we're going to listen to Drew McIntyre, who has called himself the captain of Team SmackDown. Let's see what his thoughts were ahead of this one. Second rope. Oh my goodness, a Claymore! McIntyre with a Claymore out of the air! Are you kidding me? Oh, we've got a strong team. Um, luckily, I've got it within my eyesight right here. Um, you know, we've got Woods with his newfound confidence, and he is genuinely fantastic in the ring. So we've got Corbin, and he's a giant version of somebody that's willing to do whatever to get the job done, and a legend like Jeff Hardy. Um, you want him on your team any day of the week with that experience and the fact that when, it, when I say willing to do whatever it takes with Sammy and Corbin, I mean cheap. With Jeff <laughs> willing to do whatever it takes, he'll jump off the highest point in the building and is willing to do whatever it takes to get us that victory. Who's the biggest threat on that Raw team? Um, he's got to be Big Bob for me. You know, Rollins is um, interesting right now, but in the end, he's someone I've been in the ring with a bunch of times. I know what he's capable of in the ring, no matter what he says or how stupid he dresses. He's very, very good, but Lashley's been my kryptonite. With MVP, I see MVP in the picture in the background because MVP comes along with Lashley. He's a big reason why I've not been successful winning back my title, but got to give it to Big Bob. And thankfully, as Big Corbs is walking by, if you remember in the past, the buddies of Bedlam was myself, Corbin, and Lashley. And together, these buddies of Bedlam are going to take down Big Bob. <laughs> can you take him down? Can you trust Corbin? Bring back. I can't trust Corbin, but we're on the same team. He wants the bragging rights, and together, we're going to take down Lashley I'm for all time's sake. I'm in. He's fine. On this night, maybe not other nights, but on this particular night, you know, he wants the bragging rights. Yeah, he wants the bigger payday. You know, you win the match, you get the winner's packet. So yeah, he wants that winner's packet. Money runs the world for me. Dwarf. So, Jeff, your teammate there, Drew McIntyre. Uh, these Survivor Series five-on-five -five matches have been going for years and years and years. And, and you've had a couple yourself. You had a couple of wins, I think, yourself. How, uh, how fun are these? when? When you find out that you're in one and you're like, okay, here we go. We've got this huge, long match to go. We've got all these people in the ring. We could do some crazy stuff. How excited do you get when you find out you're in them? Super exciting, I'm especially in 2021 to be in the Survivor Series and <clears throat> Drew to be the captain. I've actually teamed with Drew recently quite a bit on live events and man, we get along really good. So it should make for a great uh, chemistry there between us and our other uh, our other uh, team members. Of course. So we've got some hurt. We've got some hurt business. Maybe around the side of the ring. We've got some madcap moss. But there is so much talent. Yeah, that's it. That, yeah. that, that's that's a pretty hench five on five. Yeah. Days. But one of the things I love about Survivor Series is, like you said, yourself and Drew get <clears> along <throat> really well. But the interesting thing with Survivor Series, not everyone on the same team get along. You know, mm. you get, they might be on the same team on they paper. Might on, exactly, but they might hate each other. For example, look at Happy Corbin. Do you think he really cares about his teammates? Mm. No. You know, there's always there might be people working together so their team wins, or there might be people working together but then on their own, so they're the one who actually picks up the win. For their own agenda. For their, yeah, for their own mm. agenda. And that's the exciting thing about Survivor Series. Internal beefs. Yes. That's what we yeah. like. Yes. Team beefs. Yeah. Um, obviously that spices everything up, but it is obviously the one night a year where the brands compete for dominance to prove who is the better brand, Raw or SmackDown. But Jeff, do you find that uh, there is a thing between the rosters where it's like, okay, well, I really want to be, you know, the show to watch. I want to be the one that everyone's talking about. Everybody has to see your show, not the other. Yeah, exactly, because now it's kind of uh, SmackDown's my new home, you know, naturally after being on the, the Raw brand for uh, a year or so. Um, it's super exciting to think of this, another dreamlike scenario for me as a wrestling fan. Rey Mysterio on the other side, are you kidding me? I mean, that's a dream match that I've never had. We kind of mix it up every now and then, but just that thought alone, I mean, the little kid comes out inside of me, and, oh my God, this is gonna be so cool, because he inspired me so much, uh, oh God, before we ever succeeded in pro wrestling, and uh, just such a uh, positive influence in my wrestling career, but just that thought alone, I'm super uh, pumped to take part in this match and, and definitely want to prove that uh, SmackDown's the better, the better brand mm -hmm. by naturally winning the match. Have you had a singles one-on-one -on -one match in WWE with Rey Mysterio? Never, it's <gasps> never happened, yeah. <laughs> right, so, yeah, it's just one of those how? things. So where how? How on earth is that? How have we got to 2021? 
Th that's going to be a moment, you know, that is. We're going to get a I glimpse. hope to God that that is the, that is the like, the Rock, the, so the, the Rock Hogan-ish type, you know, esque kind of moment in that match. Is oh, absolutely. Yeah, it, was only, it was like legends. a fatal, yeah. fatal four-way or a triple, a, a triple threat match or something to where we ended up mixing it up a little bit, but it wasn't an actual one-on-one -on -one match, so. But this, like, it could be you two left as the two yeah. last people. Oh, how cool would that be? Wow, yes. that's what it's all about, man. That's why you Super. need to watch Survivor Series. <laughs> For that moment alone. <laughs>